So tonight, we're going on a magical journey. We're gonna eat some burgers. A lot of burgers. Here in Southern California, we're pretty much in fast food heaven. There are so many places. And much better places. To get fast food than, well, anywhere else in the country. This phenomenon is uh, particularly relevant when it comes to burgers. There are four amazing fast food chain places here that don't exist anywhere else in the country. The four in order of how good I personally think they are goes Fat Burger, Carl's Jr., Jack in the Box, and at the top, definitely, in and out Now I know that there are people right now groaning about my list of orders. But, um, you see, this is my fucking blog. If you want your own list, get your own fucking blog. Yeah, I don't think anyone's gonna argue that In-N-Out's the best place. That's pretty much a fact. Really, it's not even close. So, um, you may be wondering why I'm doing this. People come here from all over the country, and honestly, they... <laughs> They get confused and intimidated by the fast food places out here. I see it every day. It's a little bit ridiculous. Oh my god! What are all these? I, I, I don't even know where to go. I don't know what to order. Uh, I'm gonna spend 15 minutes in line fucking trying to figure out what's going on. This is really a public service video for them. So this is Fat Burger. Notice the little pouch. This is what we get in California. You guys don't get this love at other places. I uh, really don't have that much to say about Fat Burger because I'm not a huge fan. It's kind of like a uh, diner place when you walk in. They grill the food right in front of you, which is pretty nice. Oh, one cool thing about Fat Burger is you can get a fried egg on your burger if you want. It actually sounds a lot better than it really is. Um, I love fried eggs and you just can't taste the flavor. It doesn't come through in the burger. The burger tastes pretty average and it's overpriced, definitely. Uh, this burger that I got was like six bucks. Um, you gotta be kidding me. All I got was a burger. Although, tonight, I think it's gonna be awesome because I'm fucking starving. So, uh, here we go. I must say, that was delicious. So, now we're on to burgers I really love. This is the Carl's Jr. $6 mm, guacamole, oh my god, $6 burger. Let me take it out of its little hiding place. Oh, I mean, are you kidding me? <laughs> oh my god, I couldn't have asked for a better camera shot than this, this is amazing. Oh my god. I don't get the normal cheeseburger when I go there. The normal cheeseburger is pretty average. However, they have these things called $6 burgers. Let me explain them. You know when you go to a Friday's or a Chili's and they have those nice burgers on the menu? Well, the $6 burger is the fast food equivalent of one of those burgers. They have all sorts of toppings that they put on it and they make it really delicious. They try to use better beef. Uh, it's kind of like an imitation casual dining restaurant burger. Tonight, I decided to go with the guacamole and bacon burger. It's delicious. Oh, by the way, I forgot to mention this. The $6 burgers at Carl's Jr. are only $4.99. I don't know. So, here we go. Delicious. I love Jack in the Box. Man, people hate on Jack in the Box. I don't think that's justified. It has a nickname, Crack in the Box, which I believe is a reference to all the homeless people that frequent the restaurant. Jack in the Box concept can be summed up in one word, cheese. Every burger you get is covered in cheese. If you order a single cheeseburger, it comes with two slices of cheese. 
If you order a double cheeseburger, you get four slices of cheese. They also have mayo on all their burgers, which I believe cancels out the fat and the cheese and makes the burger healthy overall. Yeah. I get the sourdough bacon cheeseburger. As you can see, it has two slices of cheese, one on the top and one on the bottom. So, here we go. There's a chance I'm gonna throw up. In and out burger. Amazing. When you go to the restaurant, they only have five things listed on their menus. Fries, drinks, milkshakes, and for choices of cheeseburgers, you have a normal cheeseburger and a double-double cheeseburger. That's it. Nothing else. A double-double means double meat and double cheese. You can also get fried onions on your burger as well as Thousand Island dressing. There's a secret code for special in and out burgers. It's called Animal Style. I'm not really sure what it means other than delicious. So here it is, the in and out burger. This is my fourth burger in about half an hour, so uh, wish me luck. Alright, well, I'm Ryan. Again, thanks for stopping by. And uh, if you ever get to California to eat some burgers, remember this video. Have a good day.